we go. That was so weird. We had like a power blip and it took out my stream PC, but not my gaming PC. And then like the kids were in school. Just a whole bunch of things. Just, I don't know. It's Monday. We're back. Sorry about that. Uh, no, none of them are on a UPS. Yours isn't it still rebooted? I yeah, my PC completely lost power and rebooted and mine's on a UPS. So is the router. So, I don't know. But I'm still in that fight. So look, you guys didn't miss the the, the, the thrilling ending. Beat him up. Ooh, we got a new birdie. We got a new birdie skin. And we got this one. Does it have its own power? What's the power on it? Get to see it. Phosphorus clone explodes and freezes enemies for 10 seconds on a hit. What does it look like? Ah. It looks like this. It's a blue dinosaur. It's a blue little dino. Blue look dinosaur That's guy. That's cute. I like that. Yeah. New burb. All right. My gaming PC was the one that uh, reset. It would have taken a lot longer to get back up. And that fight would have been having to, we would have to uh, redo that fight, so. It could have been worse. All right, we got another fight up here. You defeated him and didn't get that? You're wondering if PC is different than Switch? I notice colors of the characters are different too. Really? Willing to move on? Huh. Interesting. I don't know. Alright, I guess I'm gonna have to fight these guys. I'm not going to be able to sneak up on him, am I? Sneak attack! in the bowl. Red thing up here. Arrows don't destroy those. Okay. We got our first blue ball. Guys, we're on the hunt for blue balls again. 
Ah, the Argo. The legendary ship named after its builder, Argus. Athena inspired its magnificent design. Athena really wastes a lot of her wisdom on these mortals, doesn't she? What's wrong with mortals? What's wrong with mortals, anyway? You're 55 hours on Switch and some on Stadia, not on PC, so watching Bog is interesting to see the colors are different. Why are they, what, what, like, colors of, like, colors of what? Like, the armor and stuff? It is a lot of hours. I, I wonder how many hours I have. Probably catching up to that. I don't know what that opened. Uh, what did that do? Yeah. Oh, mostly the characters, the gods themselves. Interesting. Okay. So what did that do? I don't know. And stay out. Push the button. Guys, I'm just walking with my ball here. You leave me and my ball alone. Goodbye, goodbye. Check below the torch? All right, I will. I'll give it a look-see. <laughs> My ball! What's up, Dragon Tears? That's not right. Oh, there's the ball. Aren't I silly? Aren't I a sillykins? Alright, we're gonna put this one. Put it right here! Two more. Hi! Was never going to be that easy there, Pilgrim. Daddy's created him for good, but he's turned out evil. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we need this, but we might. <laughs> yes, again. It's my bot reset. Just in case we need these for something. I don't know what we need them for, but we may. And I noticed there's ambrosia on the mast. You've got a little bit of ambrosia at the top of your mast. Pick it up quick, you'll be head of the class. Bake it in a stew, or put it in a pie. I've got so much ambrosia that you want to say hi. I don't know. I failed rhyming. All right, well, we need... We need more. I never figured this out. Let's go figure this one out. Okay, what do we got? We've got a hole in back of it, underneath. Which I don't know if we have access to. Hey, it's Naka! What's going on, Naka? 
knock out something in the mail for you. It's on the way as of today. Jamal or Jam Hall. Thanks for following. Yeah. Get in there. Okay. Oh, come on. What? They don't let you go up there? Oh, okay, they do. They were just being silly. Now, don't be silly. Come on. All right, now we'll go over here, we'll put the ball down the hole. Ball go down the hole. Did it go, did it go down? <laughs> Go in your hole! I just noticed you changed the button control actions. Is it better than standard or do you do standard? Do you not do standard controls at the beginning? What? What's not standard? I don't know. That's the sound it there makes when you hit 20 months of subbing. Thanks. Serious comics with the 20 months. Thank you so much. What control did I did I change controls? I don't think I did. Maybe I did. Maybe I switched where Dodge was. Your X Your Y is my X on the game. I don't know. I don't remember changing too much. All right, one more. We need one more. Yeah, I'm using a controller. Yeah. Oh yeah, if you're on the Switch, I'm using an Xbox controller. That might be the issue. All right, what do we do here? Well, light torch is on fire. Excuse me, braziers. There we go. Nothing but net. Perfect. Watch this. One shot. Don't watch. I went way. Too far. That'd been cool if it worked, though. Would have been cool. Stick your hand in and pull out a prize! Stick your torso in, maybe. All right, 10 coins of cat off. All right. So that whole island was just one big puzzle. And look at this, there's ambrosia right there that we never got. How can I never got that ambrosia? That's so far. That's so hard to climb. There's an unexplored vault and another one. There's so much stuff. All right, definitely want to teleport out of here. Otherwise, it'll take me forever to crawl out. Oh, that's what it was. You were on the switch? Yeah. 
some of the buttons. Going back and forth between Switch and Xbox is just it's just a nightmare to me. Those button swaps. I ah, can't, can't handle them. Guys. Did you know they have a rigorous process to ensure the authenticity of every document submitted? If you're trying to wipe out my desire to live, it's working. <laughs> you're trying to wipe out the desire to live. All right. Find the steel of Atalanta. Okay, it's not too far. But on the way, of course, is an epic chest. And all we have to do is fight a couple nerds. Look at these nerds! You missed. Hi, guys. Macaroni and cheese, my favorite. All right. Now let me into the treasure room. I defeated the guardians, and therefore the treasure is mine. Let me have it, please. Please let me have treasure. All right, well, we got this. Hey, climb up. Okay, now we need to set it on fire. I do it like this. Oh, I didn't see the other one over there. So I don't think you can just shoot these off, right? No, it doesn't do anything. Gotta go swing it off. It sucks that we lost about 30 people from watching just for going offline like that. What a Monday! What a Monday! Alright. Now we can get the treasure. Foot kick! New visual skin of fervid pride. Ooh, it's red. My favorite. <laughs> Bonus sound effect, demon. Is it lion armor? It was the lion armor, right? We got the red one. The creepy nails. I go back to the satyr armor. the red boar. I like this armor set. Feels more me. Alright, let's go back up. And we could take a, uh, a trip to the Hall of the Gods for some upgrades soon, too. came upon the forest of Atalanta. I did? A woman known for her stubborn refusal to marry 
and her legendary skill in the hunt for the Caledonian boar. Look, I've been married a bunch. She might have been onto something. I'm sure your wives would agree. Ha! Uh, the burn. I can't interact because I'm in combat. Really? Go down there, bear. Thank you, thank you, bear. Thank you. You like the serpent armor, demon? Yeah, that's pretty cool. You can avoid things in this game just by listening. Like I knew that boar was about to come at me from behind. See what this does. Stubborn Atalanta. First to strike and first to action. Hunt Atalanta's prey. Not too far away. Stop that rhyming now, I mean it. Anybody want a peanut? Where is your prey? <sighs> Pray tell me, where is your prey? Ambrosia, Ambrosia. Is this, is this their prey right here? 46 meters down. This is your prey? No. <laughs> Do you recall, oh. old Zeus, how Atalanta's arrow was the first to pierce the hide of the Caledonian boar? Okay. Her story was a remarkable triumph for perseverance. After her father abandoned yeah. her in the woods, and she was raised by bears. All because she was a girl. The gods, I, myself, would never do something like that. Just ask a thief. If I can get a word in edgewise. All right, so that's the story of Atalanta. Now we're gonna go through the other heroes. And they're gonna probably, yeah, they're gonna sprinkle these throughout the zone as we do the main quest. Okay, to himself. Hi, what did I miss while I was gone? All right, so holiday season is upon us. Has has anyone bought themselves a Christmas or Hanukkah or holiday present? And if so, what was it? And Marauder's like, of course I have. You were talking about this the other day. Do you wrap the stuff that's to yourself, too? Do you wrap your own presents to yourself? <laughs> you do? Really? I don't know if I would do that. That's hilarious. That's great. Robin bought a refurbished Roomba. Yeah, I think you were mentioning that the other day. 
You got yourself a copy of Phoenix? Merm, have you started playing it yet? Elizabeth got Doctor Who 9-12. Booze to get you through this season. What kind of booze? Does Cyberpunk count if I was going to buy that day one regardless? Mm, not going to say not count. Am I just going to sit here while everyone else opens? So, so your husband doesn't like shop for you or get you anything? <laughs> We're officially in love. I, a, Roomba, a Roomba wouldn't really work. Oh. I don't know. I don't know. We have like a split level, so there's lots of steps and small, you know, small floors separated, <laughs> you know? Champagne? How was my lunch break? Uh, it was it was good. I talked to my son most of it. <clears throat> and uh, I didn't eat lunch. Lunch wasn't ready yet. The Roomba can avoid stairs, but we would need, like, to constantly move it, I guess? I don't know. Yeah, you have to move it up and down, yeah. What about, what about, like, carpets and stuff like that? All right, uh, let's, let's go explore a vault. You get your own presents too, Goleman? Nobody buys you presents? You have a rug under your desk and does fine. Well, like, we have, like, entire rooms that are just carpet. Our entire, like, upstairs is carpet, so I guess we would, wouldn't use it. All right, we got griffins over here. It specializes in this part now. Okay. We have a we have a Dyson uh, vacuum that we uh, invested in a little while ago. I think we even talked about it on stream when we were getting it. And, uh, Azari loves it. The idea of a Roomba is appealing, though, because I want to see what Fizzgig does to it. There we go. Knock it out of the sky. You have one of those too, and I never use it now that you have the Roomba. How funny. I should sell them. Okay, so how do we get to the vault now that we killed the guardians? Right over here. Oh, not all the guardians. This world is mine. Ours. Oh, where's mine? Oh no! I'm doing the wraith thing again? Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. Wraith of Atalanta is back. And is this locked on me? Or can I go in? <laughs> Bye! <laughs> See ya! Okay. Taking Cerberus for a walk. Okay. Let's do it. I'm excited. Missing godly power. I'm no longer excited. A godly power you don't have yet is required to access the chest. Really? Oh, Roxy hated the Roomba. Oh. Um. So is that just for the bonus chest? Do we care? 
Ah, let's go do something else. And we're gonna come right back into the Wraith Zone. Has Fizz climbed the tree yet? Last year he climbed the tree when he was a little baby. When he was tiny, he climbed all the way up it. Um, he messes with it for sure, but it, he mostly just... We, we just put the ornaments up on the second branches and he mostly leaves it alone. <laughs> mostly. Every once in a while when he's like spazzing out, you know, when he gets zoomies and he starts spazzing, he just will dive into it and we're like, no! And like we get him out, but yeah. Okay, so this uh, raid zone is still here and Atalanta is hunting me. Uh, all right, so let's see. This is the... Okay, so the raid zone is on the map. So if I just step up here to go get an epic chest... No worries then, right? I'm sure... It won't follow us. It's following me, isn't it? Is it following me? There we go. There's the one bird ability that I use that afflicts, like, damage and stun in an AoE every time I use it. So I find that to be very, very strong, because we set the combat to hard. And it did make things more difficult, but still, we're able to uh, do pretty well with most of these fights. I got this move now too for the flyers. Discovered the temple of the once beautiful Medusa, the snake-haired monster of legend. I've seen worse. <laughs> Man, this place is pretty scary. All right, what are we doing? We've got a bow challenge. Hello. Hello. We got little cracker sandwiches? Yeah. Oh, nice. Thank you. Can okay. I have a paper towel, please? Oh, no. Yeah. No. Not at all. There we go. Talking about Roombas. Roombas are interesting. I would like a Roomba, but I don't think that um, a Roomba would be good for this house. We'd have to move it up and down manually. But yeah. Typhon's rage It'll learn and the four. Oh. I mean, but like, Phoenix slipped through his clutches. I think it would be cool. For now. But I think it would, number one, require a lot of manual labor. Um, and two, scare the crap out of the cat. Or the cat could hunt it. Yeah. That's true. Oh my god. Put little googly eyes on it. Yeah. Hey, Phoenix Rising, what's up? <laughs> what's your favorite game? That's great. I didn't see it. God bless. Hey, it's so much fun. We're going to do it again. I got to get the ability to slow down and speed up the arrow. That'll help a lot on this. Oh, I wasn't full stamina.
And if anybody's watching this for the first time or you don't know much about the game, feel free to ask questions. I'd love to uh, tell you about the game. I have to go back to the hub at some point and Athena upgrade my stuff. To behead the monster. For Medusa had bragged that she was as beautiful as Athena. Of course. Athena does all the work and the mortal takes the credit. Thank you. Thank you, Blaze again. Thanks for using my link. <laughs> you caught me at the perfect time. Um, a name change is coming soon, Phoenix Rising. Uh oh. Uh, Lee says, Which combat upgrades do you recommend to start out with? Um. Where did I start? I would recommend starting out with the utility ones down here. I don't know if you count these as combat upgrades, but they use the same points, same coins. To be able to do the mid-air glide so that you can travel for farther on, on the same amount of endurance. Same thing with swimming. You can do the swim dash so you can get places without running out of stamina. Uh, the climbing one. So you can leap while climbing to go faster. And the one where you can automatically collect the ingredients in a small range and while you're riding a mount. So get those. Yeah. Uh, because that'll just make you able to do a lot more in the game and make it a lot less frustrating like that you can't climb that mountain or you can't swim across that gap and then uh go from there like i did that like right away and i'm happy i did that um i also like um uh the air combos i find a lot of times when you're up in the air a lot of the you're avoiding a lot of the attacks and stuff like that so getting the ones that there's one i think there's one for uh the bumper and one for the trigger. So. Give that a try. I don't think you can really make too many wrong decisions, though. You can kind of, like, just craft it and play your own way. Figure it out. Alright, so what happened here when I shot... you have to shoot them in a certain order, or you just have to do it really fast? All right, I'm gonna have to use the jump in the middle there. <laughs> Do it again. Woo! Button. Okay. That's one. Uh, where else? You too enjoy Twitch? I enjoy Twitch. Twitch is fun. How do I get this block to become real? Um. See, I like these little puzzle areas because they like they they stack multiple ones. That it's like a layered puzzle. And then you gotta do like three like mini actions 
in order to complete the major action. You know, we get, we got to get something on that feather pedestal there. I don't. Can we move this? Yeah, we can move this like this. Get off of the wall! And then move it like this. Okay, that gives us this one. And then we can put this. Where can I stick this? Right here. And that's still not enough. We need something else. How about me? Still not enough. Uh, how about this one? Come here. Okay, now we got this button. Now we got the chest. Perfect. Ooh, the main of fervent pride. All right, let's make it daytime. There we go. Now I like awesome and stuff, and I like my furry legs. <laughs> Imagine having pants like that. You don't have to ever apologize for uh, having to leave John Corn, but welcome back. All right, so that's done up there. That's this is the one we we can't do yet. Uh, let's take a quick. Let's take a quick run back to our hub and uh, level up some stuff. We haven't done that all stream yet. Hope you don't mind that I eat some lunch. What's for lunch? I have turkey and cheese on wheat thins. That is already made little mini sandwiches. Some walnuts and peanuts. And some freeze-dried strawberries. In a ramekin. Isn't that a good word? Ramekin. You don't mind one bit? I always feel weird, like, being silent for a while while I'm eating and stuff. And I always feel like I have things to say. Uh, a new subscriber arrives. <laughs> it fills you with determination. I feel like there's things I want to say and then my mouth's full. Um, John Corn Dork, thank you so much for subscribing today. You're amazing. I really appreciate that. I'm glad you're enjoying yourself, and don't forget to refresh the stream because now you don't get any commercials. You won't get ads while you watch, so just refresh, and that makes sure Twitch knows your sub now. Um, and you can use all the emotes and stuff like that, too. By the way, I think that what does that bring us to? How many how many new subs did I say until um until the next game ball giveaway? You need one more now? Okay, one more. And we'll do another game ball. Okay, so we can get ourselves some stamina. So you know how we've been talking about um how this game like pulls some things from like Breath of the Wild. We were saying it earlier. They pulled this, I think, kind of from games like Monster Hunter World. Whereas like when you're upgrading something or you're getting your food or potions restored, it ha gives you a little cinematic that's just funny and silly. Huh. Huh. 
You know, stuff like this. I, I love this stuff. It's great. And you can skip it, but... It's just like... Just weird and fun and great. <laughs> so, I think, you know, it's smart to take little fun things like that the from, from games that you enjoy. And here's how we get our health up. It is a game of satire, you're right. This and uh, Dungeons of Neho book are two of the funniest games we've played this year. And they're both like, you know, satirical. All right, do I have enough? Just shy, just shy. I could do the bows. The only one I can do is bow. All right. I'm going to do bows because it'll allow me to get the uh, the four point bonus. Allowing bows to be a bit better. So we'll snag that. And I can't level up anything else. Hmm. Upgraded bows. Let me know if you're in the market for anything. Huh. All right, now we can get skills. We have 34 coins. Anything we want to do with the godly powers. Yeah, so I can try to get it so I can control the speed of the arrows. There was something else I wanted. This one. I'm going to get both of these. All right, let's get this. Control the speed of the arrows. That'll help us with these puzzles. Apollo arrow explodes on a headshot. Wow, that would be pretty good too. I could probably do both of these. All right, let's do it. Uh, this consumes four stamina chunks, but you can create a decoy of Phoenix that can be thrown to activate pressure plates. Like you can cheese more puzzles. You don't have to search for the object. You just make a clone of yourself. So let's do that. That's just cheating. I like that. Let's cheat. John Corden, you tried to do everything equal in your playthrough in the upgrades. Hey, Sango. Hey, Tan Leo. It has been a Monday. We had like my power go out in the middle of the stream earlier. That was fun. We got disconnected. Yeah. Um. Where's the strength of Hercules, John Corn? Where's that? Is it over here? Quick throw. Heavy heavy lifting, you mean this one? Oh, so maybe I should save up for that. See, I was just about to go snag headshots. All right. All right, thanks for the tip. You're right, we probably are gonna need that for some of the, that's probably what's stopping us from doing some. All right, so we need two more before we can get it. So what did we just get? Consume one stamina chunk to throw carried objects automagically. Automagically? At a targeted enemy. Bing! Completed tasks. Another thing that I love about this game 
um, is these tasks. I didn't have this quest a minute ago because I had the prerequisite, the one that was before it. Once I completed it, it gave me this quest and I'm already halfway through it. It gives you credit for stuff that you've already done. I love that. I love that. Not many games do that. And it feels great, you know? Sometimes you get on a roll, you're like, oh, I can complete like three or four in a row. It gave you the tingles? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, new task available. This one. I haven't done. Yeah. And this one just rolled over, I think. I'll have to try that at some point. All right, we got a new axe skin. And we got an ambrosia. All right, let's restore our potions smacked up to max. Boink. Boink. Just things like this, like craft max, just being being there. It's great. Um, I'm gonna. Oh, I want one more. One more of those, whatever those things are. Orange jelly beans. Need one more orange jelly bean, and then we can do the best stamina potions that we can. Yeah. Genshin does that too. Yeah, it's when you don't make when you make your game easy to play. Let me know if you're in the market for anything. All right, and then you've got a shop. Look at this helmet. I don't think I have any outfits that would match that, though. So that's a fashion faux pas. This is a cool sword. I would use that. I don't have enough. And by the way, some people were asking, like, at any point you could change what your character looks like, including... You know, you could do male to female models. You can swap that at any point. Swap the voice on your character. <laughs> Stop ripping my skin off. It tickles. I wasn't. So you can do all that. Uh, you can even uh, give yourself a beard. You know. And make it blue. Let's not apply that though. But I was just using those as props. <laughs> what? Do you want to leave me one? You are you gonna eat it? Sure, I will. Am I gonna eat a cookie? Let me let me get you let me get you one of my secret stash gingerbread men. What? Are they anatomically correct? Yeah. Um. What was I doing? I don't even know. So this is currently on top of the table. This is what I have on top of the table. Okay, this is a lot of cookies. Oh, a whole bunch of a lot, cookies. A lot of little men's. Okay. But then, sorry, that's probably really loud. I apologize. And heavy. And then I have this little bag. Here with extra little men, and these gingerbread men are the are, ones with the weed in it. They're the super chewy ones. Oh, they're the, the chewy they're ones. They're the ones that are like, like sink your teeth in. Holy crap! This is an amazing gingerbread man. I have those secretly set aside. All right, can I have one of those, please? Yes, sir. All right. There you go. They're so cute. Look at that! See-through. Green. green screen. I love that. She's very particular about her gingerbread men's. I am! Can you blame me? She wanted them all to look consistent with the icing. Okay. So I was not I... invited to help. Listen. Listen. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna decorate our own cookie 
he's on, on Wednesday. Wednesday. I know. Yes. Yeah, we're gonna decorate <laughs> our own. So, hey, I could, I could do that. You could absolutely do that. I am not unartistical. I am not saying you are. I, I have. I'm artistical. I think. I think you're fantastic, and you could make some really great looking gingerbread men. Just not gingerbread men that I gotta ship out to people. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. Um. I don't even know what I'm doing. What are we even doing? I gotta get back into this uh, this zone here. What do we want to do? We want to go up here. How can I? How close can I get? Probably not that close. Over here. Let's go. He looks like the gingerbread man from, from Shrek. He's missing his gumdrop buttons. Not my gumdrop buttons! You're a monster! The Grove of Cleos. Cleos the Grove. Okay. So, there's a, I think there's a chesticle right beneath us. Is there a test? Uh, not, not, a, not a testicle. Is there a chesticle no. down here? <laughs> Jesus. Ah! <sighs> Where? I hope you're not up. Where is the damn thing? There it is. Okay. Is that something one we're looking for, is it? That's a moon chest or night chest. I don't think I've done one of those on stream. A chest. Another chest. Oh, something up on the hill. That's an ambrosia, I'm guessing. Ambrosia? Yes. What's that? Chest. Okay. Bolt of Tartarus. A chest. Chest is below. All right, I just had to get a lot on the map there. Why is that gingerbread man naked? He's not! He's not naked. I'm wearing a scarf! It's just an invisible scarf. You can't really see it. Uh, I remember when Bog drew my card for me. It was pretty amazing, actually. I'm a little scared of what Bog would draw on a gingerbread man, though. That's true. That's true. Um... Yeah, I am, I am not like an amazing artist by any means, but I'm decent. And I can, especially if I have a reference that I'm drawing from, like not to trace, but like just so it's not conjuring it up completely in my mind, I can actually do that fairly well. So for a lot of those Patreon cards, like I would come up with an idea in my head of you know, what I thought your username looked like, but then, you know, I would Google pictures and stuff and make an amalgamation of those references for the drawing. Um, I still don't know where this chest is that's down here. It's still below. Yeah. Hi. Hi. So it might be down here by the moat. Is that where this chest is? It would be a Sharpe dog with pooch. That's oh. what it would be. That's what it would be. I would draw you a Sharpe dog. Want to do that again? Yes. 
oh, at some yeah. point. It was fun. That was, that was a lot of fun. We had to make like 40 or 50 of those drawings <laughs> in like, <laughs> like a two week period. Ah, uh, Rosal! That's great! I didn't even think about that. What about. Oh, a Shih Tzu! Yes! She just won the internet. That's amazing. That was good. That was good. That was good. <laughs> yeah, I think there's something down here. Pomegranate. <laughs> think so? Yeah. Uh, okay. There's nothing down there. This is frightening. Oh, oh! What's that? That's a chesticle. Ooh. Pomegranate! Oh, I was right! You are right! Well, look at that! There were two pomegranates in there! Is there anything else in here before I die? <laughs> Rosemont Bow, thank you. I'm here all the week. I'm here all this week. Try the veal! Once you have enough stamina, <gasps> this game gets so much fun to explore. Really, I did all that and I still had some more stamina. Stamina, stamina, stamina. Okay. That's that chest. I think there's still an ambrosia here. Oh no, we got that. Okay. Let's head this way. And we'll see what we can find. There is this blue thing here. Let's go over here. Man, shit, I can't believe it. That's fantastic. All you've done this week in the game is explore. Phoenix Rising, I, I spent a lot of time this weekend basically in this second zone here. Getting almost everything I could checked off. Like there were a couple things I missed and we'll have to go back for it at some point, but I just had so much fun. Like I knew that I wanted to do the main story stuff with the stream, but I was having so much fun just doing these like random fights and random puzzles. <laughs> It was great. You're thinking about doing New Game Plus, but this game is so much. I would, uh... If you're interested in doing New Game Plus, I would recommend you beat the game and then play a couple other things. You know? Get, get through a little bit of your backlog and then come back to it. And it'll be fresh again um maybe even start your your new game plus when we know the release date for the dlc the first dlc now always oh, have to lower the volume during combat okay that hurt we're gonna have to use some potions here. Ah, you missed. Get off the cliff! Off the cliff! I said off the cliff! You had to hit me one more time, huh? All right, bird. This chest is mine now. Ugh. Oh, I hurt my arm.
New visual. My perfection will yet wash over this land. What a terrible voice. It's a great, great bad guy voice, but man, I want to kill him just to shut him up. The Ambrosia's all the way up there. <gasps> Screw it, let's go. chest up here? What are these guys guarding? Is that where we need to go? She died. Ah! Get back up! Get back up! Your coffee looks good. It's really good. I just started to drink it. I didn't expect to fight that many bears in a game. That's a lot of bears! Okay, so that's not exactly where... The Athena thing is. What is this? This is going to be one of these complicated challenges. Isn't it? What is that owl over there? All right, we're going to go see what that is first. So the owl is part of Athena's trademark. Is there anything special? I always loved, uh, was it? Bubo? Is it Bubo from uh, Clash of the Titans? Like the 1970-something version? It's a little mechanical owl. Always loved that. Alright, I had to try to smash it. Okay, so there's a whole bunch of stuff going on down here. It was Bubo, okay. Got it. I love that movie. Remember when we tried to watch that together? And then it wasn't available like the day? We wound up watching, we watched Hades instead. Or not Hades, <laughs> I, I called it Hades. Hercules instead. Thank you, ow. Ow, quit it. Norn it. <laughs> uh, it's gonna hurt. Oh, oh, I got very 
very barely burned. Ah, oh, it hurts. You know what? No finesse. Let's just go. I <laughs> know. I don't. I don't try to figure it out at all. Just brute force it. It's fine. We don't have to use brains here. <laughs> And plenty of potions. All right, here's our first ball. Did we find where to put these? Yeah, it's gonna be over here. Oh great, oh great. Go back to napping. Go back to napping. Oh God. Where, which one? Right here. I'll fix it later. Oh, I think I got it. Ow. Okay, all right. Okay, that hurt a lot. Do it again. Oh, really? beheld the golden fleece. I did? Oh. The very fleece Jason was tasked with obtaining for a mortal king. There we go, the golden fleece! It's mine! Mine, mine, mine! Consequences, consequences, as long as I'm rich. <sighs> what a nice fleece. I'm actually running low on pomegranates. That's unfortunate. Huh. All right, what do we need to do? Something tells me it has something to do with the water. Uh, okay. Oh, here we go. Little hole. <laughs> Okay, now I'm in your inner sanctum. Got rid of that. I did this thing. And something else. Maybe. Okay, and then? I didn't finish that. <laughs> there, there's more. Uh, okay. I'm not seeing it, though. How do we activate these? Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Would you... A wise guy! This, this phoenix. We got a wise guy here. I swear he's got a mind of his own. Two more. There's one over here. So these are all like little localized puzzles. And, and there's multiple ways to do some of them. Especially the ones with the pressure plates. All right, uh, this one we've got to put something heavy here so we can light this up. Can I do that secret? How do I do that secret power? Where I create... Did I get that one? I forgot what I got.
LB and B hold. Well, I got I got a mini me. That's awesome. That's such a good ability. That's fantastic. Okay, um now we're gonna light it on fire. Did it spill out? It's over here. I've got the whole galaxy in my hand. Ugh. All right, Unamas. Unamas, 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 Mas, Mas. Nolan says, All right, you guys, time to head out. Thanks for the stream. I got a sorry, I almost poisoned on the hat. It's excitement. Got with the best of me. Be well, stay up. No worries. I didn't see it, so that's good. It's good. Uh, take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. And, uh. Fatality. Fatality. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Alaska. <laughs> What's going on? Huh. Okay. Isn't this normally like a race somewhere? Wait, what is going on here? <sighs> oh, that bird just scared me. Shush! <laughs> That's an easy way to get up here. But that's not what we wanted. Skills! Okay. Mod Cool 2 says apparently there's a way to get a heavier clone so it trips the other switches too? Really? Pretty, pretty sweet. Can I use... Um... Oops. That doesn't count as me. I'm going to throw me. It killed me. <laughs> <laughs> 